Hello, this is Chan Abraham speaking from Daybreak Ministries. Today, I'd like to share some thoughts with you about the word Trump, not the American president, but the word itself that occurs when we think especially of card games like bridge, where if we have a Trump card, which is part of the Trump suit, we're able to defeat our opponent's suits or cards. And I'm grateful to Mandy, my wife, for sharing her thoughts about this with me. We often refer to the idea that life has dealt us or someone else a bad hand or a rotten hand. And we mean that circumstances are really not pleasant. People who follow Jesus, and in fact, many of the world's great religions, uh, apart from Christianity, also believe that it's not just uh, an impersonal situation that deals us bad hands, but that there is a real personality, an evil person, and there are evil forces. But here's the wonderful thing about the beliefs held by those who follow Jesus Christ, and it is this. Yes, life does deal us bad hands, but Jesus himself has the trump card. He has the ability, the capacity, and the desire to help us to trump all the evil and the difficulties that come against us. In fact, the Bible makes this very plain because it shows us that the prime problem that we all ultimately face is death, and we live all the way through our lives in fear of death. Jesus came to defeat death and to remove from us the fear of death and thereby to give us a sense that we can succeed, we can win through life, we can find a purpose in life, we can find joy and we can find what Jesus actually called it. He said, it's life in all its fullness. So where does this take us? Well, the Bible is full of good things, of great promises. God made promises to his ancient people, the Jews, and he then came to uh, fill those up in the New Testament. And so there are amazing promises, a bucket full of them, that tell us that even in life's difficulties and tough times, God is there with us to help us and to enable us to win through. And it tells us this. How do we know that it's going to happen? How do we know God is with us? Well, it's because of this. He actually went to the greatest of all lengths in sending his son to die for us on the cross. And the Bible says, well, if he was prepared to do that, and if Jesus was prepared to give up his life on account of all of us to save us, then isn't he going to help us through the difficulties of our lives. Absolutely, the Bible says, he certainly will. He will help you and me in all of our situations. He will play the trump card because he loves us and he wants to be with us through all our situations and to bring us through to the other end safely. And that's the thought for today.